There we Who go. doesn't have an iPhone? <laughs> <laughs> hey, YouTube family. Welcome. Welcome back. Today, I have the funniest, talented, stand-up comedian, Darren Fleet in the building. Guys, are you behooved? Ooh, I'm behooved. Are you behooved? I am definitely behooved. <laughs> So if you guys don't know Darren Fee, y'all can check out his Instagram uh, and go to his comedy shows. He is very structured and hilarious. Thank you so much. Love Darren Fleet on IG, guys. Darren Fleet channel on YouTube. Yes, check him out. I'm trying so, to build my shit up like yours, girl. So today, like me, I don't even do stand-up like I need to be. So today, Darren came over, um, stopping by. Yeah, y'all will be joining us. So I just, yeah, I got to get home from going to DC for the holidays. So we just got home from DC. Where are you from? Well, I'm originally from Virginia myself, but uh -huh. I live in Baltimore too. So okay. the DMV still all there. Over. We still, still there on the east side. But today we on the south side, back in Atlanta. And today I am going to show Darren some spicy noodles. So me and Yaya, we mm. eat this literally breakfast, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> Spicy noodles. So you just told me noodles. I didn't know they were spicy. <laughs> this is spicy noodle challenge. Okay, alright. Alright, no, but it's diluted, so it's not as spicy. Okay. So the beautiful noodles and we have our pickle and cucumbers. Oh, look up peek and get the ass burn. They look like little <laughs> never crack. mind, I'm not gonna You say know, it. you know what it is. Yep, you don't yep. like them little baby. Nope, nope. Nope, 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 not nope, little. Nope, nope, not little. And we also have a spicy chicken deluxe mm. from Chick fil A. Which Ooh. I bought this because y'all know that's my favorite. Look Come on, Chick fil A. What Ooh, is that? Do we have oh. where's, your, where's your lettuce? Oh, that's, uh, oh, that's I took uncle. the lettuce and stuff off. Uh -oh, you know, that's the salmonella. I had mm -hmm. the, uh, one was for uncle. Oh my god, this looks so delicious when my mom yeah, the food for us. Okay. It should be some Polynesian <laughs> in the other bag. Let, let us try this. Okay. Heavenly Father, God, we come to you as humble as we can to uh, thank you. Thank you for your grace and your mercy upon us. And thank you for every opportunity you have given us to thrive in our career. And Lord, we just want to come together right now to say thank you and may you bless this food that we are about to receive. And may it nourish this thickness in Jesus' name, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. Did you say nourish this thickness? Come on. Okay. Come on. I'm over, I'm over all of that. God, please disregard that last statement in the name of Jesus. We know what I'm talking about. I know what you're Okay. You want chapstick? Oh, you have to I do. This should look So. I'm going to take a baby portion for starters. This is. I can smell the spice coming off this meat mix. On a scale of 1 to 10, how hot is this? Um, this Probably is not, it's not hot for us because... They eat it all the time. Oh my. Mm. Okay, let me try like meat meat. Let's see. Oh shit. Now, I don't know how to use chopsticks, so I'm just trying Thank to... Thank you. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I love cucumber, you guys. I bet you do. Let me see you do the, <laughs> <laughs> Let me see you do the challenge. <laughs> this thing is a little. No. Oh, hey, that. <laughs> that be... Ooh, it's good. So we eat this stinky sauce. No, I'll take it with cucumber. Right down. Mm. The cucumber is going to dilute the spice. We got, oh, brace your nose, okay? This, this is a shrimp paste sauce. It's called Kapik, and it stinks, but it tastes so good. <laughs> so good. I don't know if I want to eat it if it stinks. <laughs> to American, it stinks. To us, it's like, yeah, mm. I'm about to do it right now. You're Vietnamese, right? Okay, I'm doing it right yeah, now. Yeah, I'm Vietnamese. She's Cambodian. Cambodian, gotcha. Southeast Asian. Come on, Southeast Asian. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Project. Southeast Asian, we eat more mm -hmm. north side of Philly, which we eat, we eat more salty, mm -hmm. more salty and more mm -hmm. spicy than the north. So, so this is the like, stinky kapik sauce. So you be eating like fish eggs and shit like that? No, that's a uh, Japanese people. Gotcha. How is it spicy? Just a little warm. I might take off my coat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm so stinky. I'm gonna try it on the on the mm -hmm. A little bit, that's spicy. Okay. Oh, this spicy too? Is it mild or it's spicy? It's mild. not spicy. The oh, chicken mild. sandwich? The, oh, that's mild. The, the cucumber? Mm-hmm. Pickle with that. Mm. 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 What is that in quantity? Mm. 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 What is that in quantity? Mm. Mm. What's in there? Shrimp paste. Shrimp. Garlic. Shrimp, garlic, onion, shrimp, chili pepper, sugar, 
And y'all like it? Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> he said, y'all like that? We love it. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> but ladies, you gotta brush your teeth before you eat it. <laughs> I mean, after you eat yeah, it. Yeah. It's steak. <laughs> I'm sweating. Y'all are not sweating yet? Y'all good? Okay, cool. Okay. We got some water. We got some juice. Mm -hmm. Okay. You want me to grab it outside? Mm -hmm. Yes, please. 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 So Darren been over the house a few times. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. Met the kids. Just and Jay, they went to work today. I mean, they went to work. They went to school today, which is their work. Right. And Jay, well, when I met Juice, Juice would speak, but she's like very to her selfish. She's been talking a lot. Mm -hmm. Has she? Mm-hmm. Well, look at her mouth. I'm mm -hmm. acting more and more like me. Mm. Which can be a gift and a curse. Mm -hmm. What? Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, I even your blood is a gift and a curse. But her son. That's what my daddy used to always say to me. Last time I came here, Mimi went to the Hip Hop Awards. Her and her husband had to fly. So her maids and stuff were stopping by. All the guests with the children, you know, bringing them monster trucks, toys, food, whatever the hell they requested. It was just like pushing buttons and people to pop up. And <laughs> I'm serious. And I woke up because I smelled breakfast and I was like, I know it ain't nobody here this morning but me and two children. And her 10 year old son was standing up at the stove. And when I tell y'all this little boy did not make breakfast, he made a spread. <laughs> he is like the Asian Patty LaBelle. I mean, the boy, <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so serious. It was lightly buttered pancakes <laughs> with the brown around the edges, so eggs over day. easy. Uh -huh. Everything was so precise. So I called Mimi because I was shocked. I was like, Mimi, you know this kid? You know, because in black households, we couldn't use the stove until I was like 17. <laughs> my, mom, my mom never let us use the stove. Like, uh -uh, you can burn down my house. But... Are you tired of coffee? <laughs> the bathroom that way, that way, that way. You're out here, fuck. You're almost Caucasian. You can't handle this. Honestly, <laughs> but. It is very stinky. It's a very, um, how do you say it? Inquiring. Inquiring. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Long story short, black households, we can't touch the stove till we about 16, 17. I called Mimi. I said, Mimi, do you know your 10 year old is cooking? And I'm thinking, I'm telling her some news. Like, he's gonna get a whooping when he gets home. She's like, no, Darren. Tell him to cook you something oh to eat, too. You know? I'm like, what? What? It's like, that shit tastes like no, inspired you know what coochie. <laughs> Oh my god, that's nasty. <laughs> not, not refurbished coochie. Come on now. He said expired coochie. Come on now. Mm. <laughs> so I, do not, I do not recommend that sauce <laughs> to anyone. Hell no. <laughs> I do. Oh. You know whose sauce I want to taste? Be love. Be love. Oh I just god. ordered it last night. Oh Really? I've been trying it? to order it for the longest to keep being sold out. So last night she texted me. She texted me, like, it's on Amazon right now. I was all right, I'm on my way. <laughs> I don't know what that girl put in that sauce, but the way she dips it, mm -hmm. she puts her whole damn elbow in the bowl and just eat mm -hmm. it. Mm. It's good. I would too, too. When she said over here, we did the video. Um, mm. So she had leftover sauce here. That's what I did with it the next day. Mm. I, I boiled up some pasta. Food. No, I boiled up some pasta and I used her sauce and some pasta. Mm. Mm, and, I, and I had the shrimp and the mussels on top. Was it? Mm -hmm. I wish I was here for that. I be watching her every night. I love you, beloved. <laughs> <laughs> right. no, one time, I was in the car. Yaya was upstairs, but I turned my car on. Somehow, her Bluetooth <laughs> was still connected to my car, and all you hear is. I was like, who's chewing? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> it was me laughing. It was you. I would have left my whole car running because, like, stuff like that scares me. Like, I'm so serious. That's why I couldn't live here by myself. One creek on your floor, and I'm upstairs. Man, I've been hearing all the creeks. Who don't know the half of this house? We've been through hell and back at this house. Nope, no, I, nope. I, 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 Mm -mm. Don't tell. Uh -uh. Don't tell. Until me. next time. Yeah. I'm supposed to spend the night. 
I want a comfortable stand. Please don't <laughs> <laughs> like, do that. That just scared the shit out of me. All right, y'all. I just want to take a time and just reflect on what we eat. Oh, where's the where's the, the um get get the salt the um ass burner. We're having a chicken sandwich okay. from Chick Fil A, noodles from okay. Asia, pickles okay. from uh, yep. food line. Next one. Next one. Yep. It's a little jar with powder, chili powder. Yeah, mm -hmm. bring it here. Don't eat, don't finish the cucumber yet. Rack sauce. <laughs> no. So that's like what, like how cucumber I like to dip in this. Like, chili yeah. pepper what and some of the fruits and pack sauce. Yeah. So we like to eat so it's like stuff powder, with powder. Sauce. So this is like chili powder, salt. High blood pressure. Who's that from? <laughs> to go with noodles, high sodium, and chicken from Chick Fil A. Okay, yeah, we're gonna die. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna die. <laughs> he took a big dip too. That one's better than that one. It's just soft. Man, this one's way better. Good. I just, no, you need to try it, bro. Right, I'm gonna... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, nothing else to do with your life. Try it. Right. Because it's like a more salty. I don't know. He doesn't have much color, though. He might not be him. Might give him a little pigmentation. No, What is the dog? A little pigmentation. That shit right there, though. That ain't fit for a dog. <laughs> it's so funny because Mimi <laughs> is darker than Brent. And this is an Asian lady. No, you're not. Y'all yeah, y'all is darker than me. Y'all y'all is darker. Well, you are either. you are translucent. Look at you. You, you like are. rice paper. Boy, well, you like rice paper. <laughs> yes, you, you are. You like a spring roll rice paper. Right, yes, so you are. I'm yellow, okay, and I'm proud. <laughs> it's not, uh, no, that's not yellow. Uh, okay. That's, like, that's transparent. Okay. <laughs> Let me see through you. <laughs> you see right here. How do you do that? How you sing that in Asian? How do you sing uh, it with that um, Asian voice? Oh, I can do it. How do you see the way? How do you do that? How do you do that? How do you do that? How do you? How do you? How do you? How do you? Show me why. Show me why. Oh God, man, I'm not coming back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I gotta stop eating so much. We gotta go to the gym. Mm -hmm. My gut. But we still have a pink grandma's bag tonight, y'all. But there's oh two types God. of people to go to the gym. There are ones that go to actually work out, and then there are ones that go like Mimi, who's gonna be sexy, put the camera down, <laughs> and then see her buns going up. Oh, and hell no. I know what she's gonna do. Mm -hmm. I go in. What's your workout when plan? I do go. We actually have a trainer. I have a trainer, though. Mm -hmm. I work out I do sauna for like 20 minutes, then I work out for an hour or two, and then I go back where I have to do elliptical for, for like a good 20, then I do like all oh, this leg day, ab day, and then I go back into the sauna. Okay, that's the sauna. I like that. Yeah. When I go to DC, mm -hmm. I gain all this weight, like a 10, 15 pounds. Then I come back. Everybody want to cook for you said, in the DMV area. Like everybody well, cooks. When I go, I'm not working, so I'm just relaxing. All right, all right. I'm just eating. Eating, eating. You say eat too. Mm -hmm. Over there. Mm -hmm. They got good food. No one offer you. Oh, thank you. DMV, best seafood in the world. I don't care what nobody says. Mm -hmm. We're the land of the crab. Yes, God. Crab cakes. No, oh, my God. I'm going to tell y'all who got good seafood. It's in New Haven, Connecticut. It's called Nia Bottles. We never Nia been Mottos. to Connecticut, sir. Oh. <laughs> oh, been in Connecticut? God. I have. Hold on. You've <laughs> a show in New Haven. <laughs> yeah, I've had shows and I love Connecticut, but <laughs> I'm not going to say that they have better seafood over the DMV. Wow. No. Yeah, I never right. had I didn't say that. I said, I'm going to tell you, Where you got this food. Like, at the best, like New York area and stuff like that. Oh, okay. They have yeah. okay, Like New England yeah. area. Because up, the lobster come from Maine. Right. Up north awesome. in general has great seafood. Regular. Because mm -hmm. lots of beaches. So, Connecticut probably do have really good seafood. Yeah. No, it's pretty good. I can say I can that. Believe it. I don't know why I thought Connecticut Boston, was in the middle all of somewhere them. over there. No, it's mm -hmm. like right there by Rhode Island. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. where what, remember I ordered that 15, 20 pound lobster. That's it came from Maine. Called? It came from Maine. It got shipped here from Maine. That's a big ass that, lobster. No, you should have seen it. That. That and I didn't redo it. Head. I did it. It was on the top of it. Really? It was no justice. I put it in the microwave. It was so ghetto. I got to redo it. No waste. <laughs> I can't eat no more. I don't I want no eat macaroni eat. Uh, lobster. Because it was undercooked. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to throw it away. That's you know what I'm saying? I'm like, just throw it in the microwave. You know, that was ghetto. You know? I'm not going to say that about you, and, but you know you're ghetto. You know it. You know, you know like from Christy Yamaguchi. This is the fanciest ramen noodle dish I ever had. And for real. You know, from from Christy Yamaguchi to, let's see. 
Mia Yami. Mia Yami. My name is Mimi. And I'm Yaya. And together we are Mia, Mia Yami. I love that. <laughs> it's so good because it sounds like one of them little sushi. <laughs> <laughs> Like, like a Mortal Kombat game or something yeah. like that. I pick me a Yami. Me a Yami. Two bitches in one. Oh, oh my God. We need to do that. Mm -hmm. yeah. However, Mimi is by far one of the most ghetto Asians I've ever met. I'm, and I you have Google to, her. I have to say <laughs> if you Google her, the most ratchet Asian girl, you know how to pop it, up. And it's, uh, really? Go Google it. I'm about to. Go to Google and look up the most ratchet Asian girl. You both. I'm so serious. I like all the girls I've ever grown up. Like I, I'm always been drawn to pop culture, uh -huh. K-pop. Uh -huh. oh, oh, oh. Yes, I love. I love to anyone. They're my girls, uh, and it's something about them girl. because they look good on screen. Like the Bob. The, the first the, thing that comes up is lovely Mimi. <laughs> lovely Mimi. Instagram. Lovely Mimi. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no bullshit. If you go, is lovely Mimi. Lovely Mimi. <laughs> lovely Mimi. I don't even think they put another Asian it's on this no bitch. You're the only ratchet. one. She's the only one from a whole, all the Asian countries. Everyone knows that Mimi is the ratchet of all of them. Oh my yeah. God. This the killer. It's like, <laughs> I love how this one went in. She do look like 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 she do she used the n-word too. <laughs> <laughs> I just say ATO Ratchet Asian girl. She uses the N word too. Oh my God! Oh, no. No. Let, me, let me be honest. I but, don't. I do not say the N word on my videos or because I think I made one a video four years ago and it got so much controversy. So that I just you know respectfully I was like you know I'm not gonna use the N word publicly. But to my friends and stuff like that who knows me, we chilling and da we talking, we telling stories. Then you know it's comfortable. They they know. I'm who just I gonna am. be but honest. I respect people as far as online wise. The so origin of Asians is African. And if you know anything about it, no. Yeah. So we all like a, if the boat came, we all. Why are they all them Chinese over there? Why are they? Maybe, they, maybe, maybe oh, next wow. time you're hitting the But back to the N word situation. Um, me somebody, she, somebody called me and messed up with them. I don't believe in like, okay, this person get a pass, that person get a pass. But what I will say is, maybe got black children, black cousin. Doesn't but make people, it okay or not, but people are so sensitive about the wrong things. And I'm not saying that, okay, you could just go around saying it or make it. But... Not I mean, ignorantly, you know? Right. I mean, Cardi does it, J-Lo has right. done it, and these are people who are... In and our I, community, it, right. when I think of you, I don't even think of Asian girl. <laughs> I think of that Asian woman. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I, I do a lot for the community, especially for the urban community. You do. As far as like my workers and um, different businesses, I support a lot of uh, different black businesses. Uh, so you hire like, mostly black people. Well, Your yeah, whole salon is black. You're the only Asian. In there. <laughs> You're right. I'm like, oh, she's the only Asian in her salon, and that's un, you know, that's unheard of. The reception is as black, and so, <laughs> so it's not like oh, okay. They get to handle the money. Right. It, it kind of reminds me of the Chick Fil A thing. People always say, "Well, Darren, why do you support Chick Fil A? They don't like the LGBT." But every time I go to Chick Fil A, I always see. A little queen in the drive-thru with a red mohawk and an eyebrow ring. And, and my pleasure. So I'm like, you know, it's, it's like that. Like you can't, I, I, I don't see, I, me personally, I didn't think of it as a big deal. So for them to even put yeah. that on Google is stupid. It's I believe stupid. everybody has an opinion about things. But when it comes to being in a social life and stuff like that, oh, we have to um, respect people. Mm -hmm. And what, you know, if it, if it been a lot of people or half of the people or one fourth of the person, Okay, I'm a respectfully, you know, not say it. So that's right. why. I don't think you're going to just come to a black cookout and be like, what's yeah. up, my N-word? What's up, N-word? I'm like, you are N, you are N, you are N. No, like, when, we, when, we, when we say it, I ain't saying he a gold digger. And you say when he ain't messing with no gold I'm like, okay. Uh, <laughs> that's how I saw it. Yeah. <laughs> like, who cares? It's yep. not, it's not, it's not. You know, yeah, you can't black. sing Lil Wayne songs without it. You know, I know, I'm a Lil Wayne fan. I put a hole in it. Right. Me, I, I, I don't like the day. I, I would have to walk around sounding like the radio version and shit. But, this, but sometimes the N word is the most important part of the song. <laughs> right. Really? It's, it's, God, it's a, did you say that B I G, ma? You yeah. know, like, how can you not say that? It's like, why you keep liking that out? But you know what? Because I think you're being racist by purposely blanking it out. I'm like, now, no. now, <laughs> like, what, do you know? what do you feel about this? Now, I was, I was looking at Instagram, and there was a, a young boy, and he uses the word a lot. Mm -hmm. But when you look at his page, he don't hang with nobody black. What's his page? I, I don't. I don't remember. We don't want to. Uh, we don't want to do that. <sighs> it was a few years ago. 
but he don't hang with nobody black. His girlfriend's white. I think he's like mixed because yeah, he kind of look like you. But he yeah, he good looking. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. The things we tell ourselves. Okay. But but he, he he has I guess he was half black, but everybody he hang with is white. Everything was just it was just white, but he's constantly using it and. How do you feel about that? He don't hang. He don't hang with nobody black. He ain't hit. He ain't urban. So, I, I but he it. can because his parents were born. But mm -hmm. as far as being in the environment, actually, you know, living and you know, being a part of community, I don't think he's part of no community. I just but feel like this: if you have, if you're mixed, you're white and black. Don't. Okay. Don't use being black at your best convenience. You know what I mean? Or you know, when, white when, at when, your best convenience. right, 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 right. And you know, and and I'm and, and I don't. I, I get mixed people go through a lot. I really, really do. But like, even with Mariah Carey per se, I've always seen her as a black woman. So if she said that's my n word right there, I wouldn't be upset with Mariah because she's always been. In the, what you cannot do is just decide I'm gonna be in a black community when it's convenient. But when the cops pull me, I'm back on my white side. You just can't do that. So stop using it to the best. Of, if this is who you are and this is what you are, I feel like it's what mixed people. It's one you normally identify with. And it's probably the way you grew up, but I don't know. I've not mixed. Mm -hmm. well, but that's just my opinion about it. A lot of people tell me, what, what I get a lot from uh, the, the people who are, you know, pro or call me culture culture, stuff like that. They'll say like, oh, they want to be black so bad until it's time to be black. But they don't even, I feel like they don't, you don't even understand what I went through. Like. Being Asian and growing up in the That's community. like us saying, y'all mm -hmm. wearing our Chinese, Malaysian, Japanese hair. Right. Y'all going to be Asian. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> but, but I just feel like when I watch The Real, it's all colored right, it's women out colors. there. These are, colors. This is ethnicity. Yeah. When I look at you, I look at like the struggle like no. me. Mimi knows. You from the DMV. You know the struggle the just strug like myself. But see, the struggle mm -hmm. of, of but, but being not, I'm not the first generation. My kids are the first generation. I was born in Vietnam. Right. So for me to be born in a third world country, and this is not just Asia. This refers to Brazil, Italy, uh, Russia, like all other states, all other countries seem to have, do, dislike the black culture. Right. You know, mm -hmm. they're always hating. They always have something negative to say. I don't know, is it? The way that the USA from from slavery and all that stuff Absolutely. that, that the way it's portrayed, they portray right. black people. So for me to be a, a, an Asian, not a first generation, to even like black people, I got hell growing up for even being around black people for wanting to date black boys. Like I my cousins, and... oh my god, they, my cousin would say evil things to me. Like um, other other Asian family who found out, oh, I hang with, black. I wasn't even allowed to hang out with my Asian friends. But I'm paving the way for young girls now, young Asian girls, like the first generation, second generation coming to America. They, they would write me, they're like, because of you, I can tell my mom I like black boys. You right. know, I can make it be cool. It's okay to, to like black people or, you know, to want to date or to love whoever you want to love. So I went through hell growing up to even be a part of the black community. I can understand that. And I told Put some respect on my name, sis. <laughs> yeah. okay, I'm about bang bang in a two doubt. Know a couple gang bangers that it takes so. Forgive me, Lord, for turning turn dirt into gold. I don't know that one. Try me. If you dumb or you slow, she I ain't never been enough. a snitch, no. I cannot fall. If you want to square up, I got punches to throw. Fight okay, me just and what? Cause this money gon' grow. Nope. Sit down. I ain't asking you hoes. Me, oh. me and Yami. <laughs> Thank you for Okay, because I didn't know where to come in. I was just going to do the, the ad the lib. Pose. 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 Well, thank you guys so much. Uh, I got to go to work. So, we are going to clean up. Too. Great conversation. We will come back. Thank we'll you guys. guys. Make sure you fair follow. Uh, we love uh, we love Darian Philly. Spell it. Girl, she she's so Asian right now. We love her at that end. <laughs> That's not my love Darren Fleet. L O V E D A R R E N F L E E T. Make sure you follow me on IG and on YouTube. It's the Darren Fleet channel. It was close. He made a bit. It was a little bit. Make sure you check out Yaya and stay tuned for our new project, Mia Yami. And follow Translucent. <laughs> follow the camera guy back there. His name is Vote for Brent, guys. Vote for Brent on IG. 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 No, they can't even see me. You can stay from this angle and then go back and do your job. Y'all can follow me at IG at Vote for Brent, V O T E F O R B R E N T. Mama, I love you. You like kidding me. Mama, I love you. Mama, I love you. Mama, I love you. I'm on YouTube. I'm on YouTube. I don't made it now. I'm on YouTube. 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 I